New opportunities are on the way for high school athletes. On Wednesday, the South Dakota High School Activities Association Board of Directors voted to approve student athletes using their name, image, and likeness to make money. Kettle Lens Jordan DeSmith talked to a high school coach and a college athletics director to see how the ruling will affect athletes at both levels. The new ruling from the SDHSAA will allow athletes to make money from things such as public appearances and social media posts. Well, income's always good, and uh, uh, when they have time to work as well with balancing the busy lives of being a student athlete, um, you know, that's, that's good for them, and it's good for exposure. But the athlete's member school cannot be involved. We stay out of this one, and that's the right, right way to go with the schools uh, staying out of it, uh, not being mentioned. One former high school athlete thinks it can boost hometown pride. Having support from them financially as well, and you can push yourself out, market yourself out, I think that just helps the town grow more. And it will be important to address some potential drawbacks. It's got the possibility for distraction, but it's up to the student athletes and the coaches and the programs to uh, keep things focused on the team and um, contributing to the team. If athletes can make a college roster, administration at the University of Sioux Falls hopes to continue NIL opportunities. You know, I don't want those things to slow down. I want to be able to help promote and, and help um, those things to continue um, at the next level if they are getting them in high school. Jordan DeSmith, Kelloland News. Athletes are not allowed to use any team logos or facilities or promote illegal substances and activities.